My name is Bex and today we're at Zombat Ka in Long Bien in Vietnam, in Hanoi. So today is, it's a collective exhibition. The original kind of inspiration from this was from a zine that I create, Made in Vietnam Zine. And I got involved with the zine through Hanoi Zine Library, which is another group that started here a few years back. Uh, Hanoi Zine Library has a collection of over 300 zines from all over the world. And the intention of the group is to try and encourage many Vietnamese people to learn about zine culture, try and create some of their own, and be able to see work from all over the world. So the zine that I now create was sort of a product of my experience working with them. Zine culture is just, it has such a rich history, and it started around the 1930s just with sci-fi fans making their own um, books to pass amongst themselves. And then it picked up a little bit more of a reputation around the 60s with, uh, there was a Star Trek zine called Spockanalia, and it had that fan fiction side to it. And, uh, and then it really kind of came into its own around the 80s. The thing that draws me to it, it's partly the history, but also how it, zines have something for everyone. You know, we have the zine set up here today and they're looking at people as they explore them, it's interesting to see what they're drawn to. Maybe they're just drawn to something that's more design-based or something creative, or it's a topic that they're passionate about. But I think the part that I enjoy most is collecting the book from the printers and then drilling the holes and sewing it, actually seeing the book become something, is that's pretty amazing. The first thing that I made was more like a traditional zine. I just made it at a local photocopy shop, pretty low budget. And then when I started to make the second one, I wanted to push myself with how far I could take the idea of design and yet still make it affordable. I try to not charge more than the actual price of making it because I want it to be something that everyone can access. I don't want it to be some sort of elite art book that no one can afford. I want it to be something that you can go around to an event like this and just pick up and take home and share with people. It's something so simplistic, yet it's such an easy way to build a community. What I hope to do through the zines and trying to run some zine making workshops through our events is to show young Vietnamese people and um, expats that come to the events as well that it's so easy to take your content and form your own community. I don't want to have all the rights of making these books, I want other people to do it. I would love it if tons more people started making the same sort of thing or their own version of the thing.